Hey, good news from the world of science. In the future, we'll all be tan and celebrating Carnival. A recent study claims that a few centuries from now, we are all gonna look like Brazilians. So let's find out why on Weird Science. We're going Brazilian. As humans blending our genes, the ones that make us look like Brazilians are the most dominant. Dr. Ann Stone, professor of human evolution and social change, tells us all this mixing is for a reason. If you look at marriage records, people usually married somebody who lived within a mile or five miles of their house, historically within walking distance. That increased with the invention of the bicycle and increased a bit more as the car and, and everything else has come out. Thanks to today's simple travel, the world is shrinking. We are meeting people we never would have met 100 years ago. In the US, blue eyes have grown far less common. 10 years ago, one in six non-Hispanic white Americans had blue eyes, while more than half did 100 years ago. Evolutionary biologists say that because the bulk of immigrants to the U.S. are from Asia, Africa, or Latin America, any trait more common in Northern Europeans than the rest of the world will get less common in the near future due to immigration. To top it off, the Northern European nations that are the stronghold of blue eyes and blonde hair are mostly below population growth. While the rest of the world continues to populate with gusto, the average American skin and hair color will probably darken slightly and there will be fewer people with very dark or very pale skin and hair, aka Brazilians. So get ready to mix a batch of mojitos and shake those feathers. That's weird science.